All right, I have a video, so I was going to talk about it, and now I'm going to talk about it. All right, so about the whole, like, age thing, is like, why do people care about their, care about freaking anime characters or fictional characters' ages so much? Why do you care about that? It doesn't matter. They're not real. They're not real people. <sighs> it's like, the dumbest thing that I've seen from people like talking about ages of certain fictional characters like Knuckles or even Lollicons in anime saying that it will breed of it will, oh, I'm sorry it'll breed a generation of kitty diddlers <coughs> sorry about that um just to just to let you know no 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 it won't no it won't I know you're looking at my big ass nose right now and I don't care big nose power baby but anyway it's simply the fact that saying that people who like lollicons... Hell, I used to do it to my friend back in high school. But people who like lollicons will somehow become a, kidly di a kitty diddler in society is dumb. It's really dumb. It's so stupid. Because that's not how behavior works. It's like the same vein of saying that video games, violent video games anyway, cause real-world violence. Like, say, GTA, Call of Duty, fighting games like Mortal Kombat. It's like, I have played plenty of GTA, I have played plenty of Call of Duty, I've played plenty of Mortal Kombat. And just to let you know, I'm in my freaking 20s, and I have never, ever wanted to freaking go to an airport with a freaking LMG and shoot a whole bunch of people up just because I saw it in a video game. That's not how this works. That's not how any of this works. So yeah, I don't understand people when they want to talk about fictional characters' ages all the time. They're fictional characters. Why do you care so much? Focus on the real. Focus Focus on, you know, real life. Focus on real life. Don't focus on fiction. Like, fiction right here, real life over here. Like, focus on things that you can do to improve the real world. And not something that you want to try to make entertainment out to be some weird, like, psycho kind of shit. That's not how this works. Like, I've seen so many tweets, I've watched so many videos, I've watched freaking Hero Hey videos, I've watched, um, Yellow Flash videos, talking about how freaking young these characters are, but that's the thing, they're not real, they're fictional. Stop worrying about fictional characters' ages, it doesn't matter. Like, if a character is, like, freaking 15, 16, okay, so what? That doesn't mean anything. And about the whole, like, you know, pornographic aspect of it, it's the internet. Like, sorry to say, it's the internet, okay? The internet will do what the internet does. If there is literally just something, even by its lonesome, it'll there will be porn made of it. And there's nothing we can do about that, aside from just accept it and move on. Ugh. <sighs> I don't get these kinds of arguments. I really don't. It's literally like the most arbitrary thing to me because for some reason we need to focus on weird things like the ages of fictional characters or the agency of fictional characters just like the fact that they have no real world agency. They may have agency in the freaking series that they're in but aside from real world stuff they don't have any agency. Sorry to tell you that but they don't. Look, I'm not saying that you can't be worried about this kind of stuff, but let it actually have a real-world application instead of trying to go after people who otherwise wouldn't know who you are until you made fun of them. And honestly, it's kind of pathetic that people want to take so much umbrage with fictional characters, but instead of actually, you know getting the actual people who diddle kids, they want to treat them as heroes. That's disgusting. <sighs>